What's up, everybody? Today is February 11, 2019, Monday TGIM. I love Mondays, but I don't like Mondays whenever the market is slow. And today I was watching the markets, didn't place a trade, although I did get a signal, but it just didn't quite line up with my strategy. I got 500 subscribers. Awesome. I'm so ecstatic about that. I'm so happy about that. I'm halfway to my goal of a thousand. Thank you so much, everybody, for your love and your support. Um, I greatly appreciate it. I, I, I've, I love doing this for you guys. I love doing this for, for myself as well. Um, with that being said, since I'm halfway um, to my goal of a thousand, I thought I would share with you a little bit about my strategy, my algorithm, and I'm going to give away one indicator, although I've mentioned it before, but now for a fact, I want to give it out to you guys um, absolutely free and let you know a little bit um, just, just, you know, putting my, my algorithm together, here's a piece of it. So whenever, whenever I hit a thousand subscribers, I'm going to give everything away. So the one indicator, I'm going to give you one indicator out of the entire algorithm. And that's the implied volatility indicator. Um, I've said this before in a uh, video in the past, and I don't quite understand it yet. I still don't quite have a good grasp of exactly how to fully benefit from this indicator, but it is in my signals. Let me show you what it looks like. Let me show you how to uh, load that indicator into your charts. You wanna right click um, anywhere in your charts, go to studies, edit studies, and you're gonna go down to the eyes, and there it is. IMP volatility for implied volatility. Apply, okay, and then you get this uh, blue line here. Pretty interesting, very, very interesting. And if we zoom out, you can see it only really works during the market, uh, while the market is actually open. And then, you know, it has some weird hiccups here and there, but I uh, highly suggest you take a look at the implied volatility and um, and play with it, uh, put it into your strategy, see if it'll work for you. As you can see here on SPY, this is the five minute chart of course, I got a signal, a, a red arrow here, and I didn't play it because of this indicator. This indicator saved me. Um, again, um, I'll, I'll explain to you in full detail once I hit a thousand subscribers, what I actually look for. And um, you know, I'll, from from when I started actually looking into the implied volatility indicator, I'll let you know what I've come up with. It might be incorrect, it might not be, who knows, but I still want to explain to you how I use them once I have a thousand subscribers, guys. Put that indicator up on your charts, guys. Uh, start looking at it and, and really putting your strategy together as well. There's a very particular way that I use it. Again, I'm not gonna give that away yet. And that's why today when I got a, a signal, I knew not to trade um, because of that implied volatility indicator. Pretty interesting stuff, guys. So um, thank you so much, guys. Um, I greatly appreciate your support uh, through my channel. It means the world to me that I have 500 subscribers. I didn't think I could, you know, put together 50 subscribers. So to have 500 subscribers, that's just amazing to me. So thank you so much. Don't forget to like and share my video and comment down below what you thought about this video. Um, also, if you have not yet subscribed, uh, this is your first time watching my video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that bell notification so you get notified the moment that I put out a video, guys. Maybe a little tough for me to trade um, this week because I do have my son more. He has uh, off a couple days from school because of President's Day on Monday. Hopefully we can get a, um, a trade in uh, sometime this week. So thank you so much, everybody for watching. I greatly appreciate it.